high to dry. It cannot hang low and it cannot lay down. So I tie mine up here. I have sinew at home that I would tie it in a knot and then I would make a loop. Whoops. And then I would tie it up high. Another, if you make uh, those bundle sticks that I see in the store, you would tie it around here with two and then you go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth to make a bundle. You would do it when it's um, down like this. You have to let it dry for a minimum of two weeks because you want to get the moisture out of the stem before you actually use it for a smudge. Please take a leaf and a little bit of an end and see if it's dry in two weeks. They say two weeks, but I've normally let mine dry for at least a month before I actually use it. Then when I use it, I'll take little chunks and I'll roll it into a ball. The stems that are here, you can put them inside your smudge, so nothing on this sage should be wasted at all. Everything can be burned. My seeds that are here that I've, I've thrown most of my seeds back into the field. There's some, of course, that I haven't thrown in. These ones, when I do my tying or I bring it down to get it ready for a smudge, they'll come off and I'll collect them and I'll save them in a paper napkin a white one and then I will throw them out into the grass or out into the field behind my place in the springtime and hopefully it'll reseed someplace else. Any questions? That's pretty much it. <laughs>